morning. Just a quick update for you here. Um, we have been very busy. We finished our autobiographies last week, um, which is wonderful. And I'm going to grade those and then they can come home. We've got them set in some a beautiful book report um, cover so that they can keep them forever and ever. And they did a really good job on those. Uh, we've been practicing with chemical reactions. We did, we made some slime last week uh, and <clears throat> we're still working on different elements. This week is the geography test on Wednesday. So hopefully they're prepared for that. And um, in two weeks, just a reminder, they'll have both their book report, which is a poster, presidential poster on a biography. Um, that'll be due on the last Wednesday of the month. And then also their poems are due that week because it is the week before break, October break. Yay, it's coming. So um, just be aware that they have two weeks, actually three weeks, three, two and a half, um, to get those things done. I will take early poems on Monday and Tuesday, but they have to be um, recited by that last Wednesday of the month. That is also book report day. So um, hopefully they're working on one or the other or both and we'll have them ready by then. Um, that week also will be um, parent-teacher conferences. I sent out a sign-up. A lot of you have signed up. If you haven't, you want to jump on and sign up. If there's a not a time on there that works for you, contact me and we'll figure it out. We'll get a different time um, before or after school or something. And then um, next week, we also have our first field trip. We're going to the Musical Instrument Museum and looking at instruments and music from around the world, which is kind of our theme for this year, is around the world. So um, it's a great trip and the kids love it every year. And we're also doing a drum um, class with um, African drums. So that'll be really fun. Uh, I need six chaperones. Chaperones do not have to pay. Kids will. You'll see that <clears throat> field trip permissions have come out today in their red folders. They need to be back in with money by Friday. And I also um, need six chaperones. I'll take first come first serve. And how I do it every year is um, I try to spread it out. So we will be having another field trip in the spring. We'll be going to medieval times. So if you don't get to go on this field trip, then you can go on the one in the spring or I'll try and make it so that everybody gets a chance. And then we'll also be doing science camp in the spring as well. So, um, and we'll need some parents for that. So I'm trying to make sure everybody gets a chance to be involved. And so if you are interested in chaperoning, um, please hit me up on Remind. Let me know. It's for the 21st and we'll be gone most of the day. We'll be back around probably two. Uh, so if you'd like to do that, um, let me know and I will make my list and then I will let everybody know who made it in for chaperone this time and those who might need to wait for next time. But um, I am loving all the support that you guys give and the, the flexibility that you have and the desire to be in the classroom to help. And definitely we're gonna need your help. Um, also next week, we're gonna be doing Egyptian masks. And so I might be reaching out to some of you, maybe come in and help us with that. Um, Cause it's, you know, it's a process. It's not hard, but it's a process. So more hands makes lighter work. But anyways, um, we're in Egypt right now and we're having a great time with it. And uh, that's pretty much it. Learning every day, moving right along. Uh, if you have any, once again, if you have any questions or concerns, please feel to reach out to me at any time. And I'm more than happy to get back with you and talk with you about whatever you have questions about. Um, I love your kids. We're doing great. And we will see you soon. Bye.